More now on this timing of Hurricane Arthur. It's already impacting July 4th plans, as he mentioned. The city of Boston has moved its renowned fireworks show from tomorrow night to tonight to keep ahead of that storm. So what about the Capitol celebration? Suzanne Kennedy is outside the Capitol with where things stand. There were ominous clouds hanging over the Capitol this morning as rehearsals got underway for tomorrow night's concert. Hurricane Arthur and its impact on the 4th of July event is on the minds of performers and the show's host. Any concerns about weather? <laughs> no, you think? <laughs> Any concerns about weather? Why would we be? The 8 o'clock event tomorrow night may feel the backside of Arthur, which ultimately could be good news. Based on what I've seen so far, it's likely to impact our dress rehearsal, but could very well give us the best weather for the actual show that we've had in several years. The fireworks display is set to begin at 9:10 tomorrow night. The National Park Service says it will make the call as late as possible to make sure there is reason to postpone or call off the event. One of the things that will cancel it is high winds. Um, that's our big concern right now. We can shoot off um, the fireworks in um, rain, but not really heavy rain, and we can't do it with lightning or high winds. The the Hubbard family of Colleen, Texas is praying for good weather for their first fourth in D.C. You know, we're looking at the weather, uh, just hoping we can get through the fireworks. I bought ponchos, I got umbrellas and everything like that, so I think we'll be able, we'll be able to still stay out. If you do plan on attending tomorrow's events and you want up-to-date information about any possible cancellations or postponement, you are urged to text July the number 4 DC to 888-777. That will provide updates for you throughout all of tomorrow's festivities. Reporting in Northwest Washington, Suzanne Kennedy, ABC 7 News. Okay.